Hello and welcome back here to the channel. I'm Evil Rabbit. We're here on Fortnite Horizon 5 doing a open drift adventure. And we're going to see what it's all about. So make sure you follow me in all social media, all the front description box below. We're here with a 350Z that has an LS in it. We're going to be doing some drifting in the open online drift adventure. Like I said, make sure you follow me in all social media. If you're not subscribed to the channel, I would appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button. And as always, let's get to it. So we are waiting for it to fast travel all the other players in. We've never tried this before, so this is the first time trying this type of event. It was in the multiplayer, like I said, it open drift adventure. So we're going to see what it's all about, and hopefully uh, this LS350 can hang. Uh, the gear ratio is not the best, so we did uh, start building this 350Z, so I will get more into this Z on another episode because we all know my love for Zs. So... Let's uh, wait so we get everything fast traveled and the event can start. So I'll see you guys once the event starts. Okay. So we have all the drift points to get. Probably chose the wrong car with the wrong gear ratios. So this is all just about pure drifting. And we're trying to get as many drift points as we can. Dude, S14. Got this, we're in first though. Let's go! Racking in the points. With, uh, most hated Ken. It looks like it's just, just based off time. We have a bit of a substantial lead right now. In the Z? I like how it keeps a running total, so. We got this guy in front of us is uh, catching up to us at points. Throwing all the manjis. E36. I'm kind of glad we're ghosted. Oh, that's going to be bad. Oh, that's not where I wanted to go. We need a gear ratio change. Is it only one lap that we get to test? I'm not sure if it's recording this lap actually. I think it only records your main lap. Yep, that's exactly how it is. Now I'm learning how this game works. I'm 
Tech. We were able to take second, though. That's pretty good. Let's see if we can't mute my microphone here. Mute the microphone there so they can't hear me when I'm talking. So, uh, looks like we took second in the first one. So, we're going to be going. So, it takes the total of your points from your one lap. So, that's good to know that it's not accumulative. So, we need to make sure we get a banger lap there for sure. So, we did get 307 to 334. So, we uh, managed to get 16 points. We got two more events in this. So, this is actually quite fun. I'm actually very... Uh, Interested to see how we stack up against some other drifters here with this Z. The Z definitely needs uh, some tweaking. And, hmm, 23.50 in that E36, taking the first. We took the second spot in this first round. But we do have two more rounds in this event because it was a three-event series. So hopefully we can uh, get some more points in the second run. So if you guys have done these drift adventures, let me know down in the comment section down below if you guys won or whatnot. So we're fast traveling to the next event. So once we get there, we'll uh, get back in this. And uh, now that we know how this works, we're going to go full send. Now that my mic's muted and these guys can't hear me talking, which probably was a little weird for them, you know. So now we are in a Bola Ocho, Bola Ocho circuit. And we are in second place currently. We're about the same uh, brack tree, but I need the gear ratio to be changed a lot in this. So let's uh, hopefully get another high scoring set in this track. This track looks like it could be uh, very uh, driftable without too many manjis. Earn the highest points and si score possible in a single lap. I should have read that in the beginning. Let's do it. LSZ. Let's go. All right, race start drifting. Gotta stay sideways as much as possible. As we screw that up, I can't see anything right now. It's almost like I'm in a seto. Not able to see anything. Oh, this is a very short circuit. Gear ratio might be correct for this track. All the clutch kicks on that one. Ah, uh, we're not doing the greatest so far on this lap, so. Slowly gaining our points back, though. Got to hit the wall. We were not too far off, but we did lose a lot of points in the beginning of this lap, so we're going to try and pick it up in this lap. A lot of manjis to trying to get all the points possible. Now we're on a five times though, so we'll get more points as long as we can keep it. Ah, we failed that turn. We're down in fourth. Unfortunately, we need to step that up. Clutch kicking it out. There we go. This section. Oh, we got it. We're getting more points this lap, though. I don't think we're getting up to 245 mark, though. I'd be happy with another second place so far. 
Ah, oh, just shy of second. We had enough time to do another lap, I feel, though. We definitely brought a uh, knife to a gunfight, I feel, with this car not being fully tuned up or not having all the power that some of my other cars I couldn't bring an FD card that's what I was hoping to bring unfortunately it said no to the FD cars I wish I could know if I was better or worse so far on a lap like if I had a little bit of a, a gauge based on where my positioning on the track is I feel like I'm not better this lap at all. So it looks like we're going to take a third place in this one. So we took third on the second one, which means we're going to be going into the third one with some points, but... With some other people joining in. But it looks like Moon was below us this time, which... Was the one who had higher points than me. So some newer people up in the top of the ranking. So we might be able to take up into the first point section. With one more event to go on this online drift adventure. Definitely a fun thing in this game. Having a lot of fun. Definitely going to have to tune up the Z a little bit better for these drift adventures I feel. Going to have to add some more power. Change the gear ratio up. And things like that. So now I am tied with... Hmm, 2350 in his M3 going into the final 30, 30, and 26. So we need to stay above him in this third and final one because if we're going to want to take a W or possibly stay up there, we're going to need to come home with a good score in this third section. Drift Adventure, definitely enjoying it. Hope you guys are enjoying this episode here on Horizon 5. A little bit longer of an episode. Some people have been asking me for some longer episodes. So we do have a longer episode here for today. Could be doing a lot more of this here for this week. We're going to be fast traveling to the next event. The final event of this Drift Adventure. Three rounds of the Drift Adventure. And uh, hopefully we can come out with a win. We're at Horizon Mexico Circuit. Not sure how my uh, gear ratio is going to fare with this. But we do just got to stay above hmm, 2350 and see if we can... Yeah, my gear ratio might not work too well. But we're going to go full send and see what happens. Uh, Force gear is a little sluggish on this car. We may have to be doing a lot of clutch kicking in order to keep this car in sideways. We do have a, a Supra, Arc 7, Sylvia, another Supra, a C63 two E36s and a 286 and then my fair lady Z third and final race here in the drift adventure we were not centered like I said we gotta stay above hmm so okay, throw on the manjis to get as much points as we can but like I said my gear ratio is not really set up for this track oh, that's gonna be a hard hit just saw that turn coming Well, the guy I wanted to stay above is currently not driving. He has zero points so far, so we might be able to pull home a W. I need to get back in the speed. And definitely need to tweak this car. 
I don't want to run this car in these drift adventures. All about the Manji down the straight. I kind of got screwed up in some of the turns, some of the sections, so we're going to try and get our second lap better. Alright, get back sideways! There we go. Trying to stay in power. But this section is actually causing me to lose points. We gotta not smack into this wall right here. Pull ourselves down so we don't smack into it this time. We should be at better off points now. But not smacking that wall really hard. We got this, baby. We should have more points this lap. Nowhere near the 40, nowhere near the 5,200 or, or 522,000 that first place has. Like I said, I am a little bit at a disadvantage in some sections of this track. And I think we're going to take fourth, but we did stay in front of... 2350 so hopefully we'll be able to take the win in this first drift adventure or maybe at least a podium as long as the game doesn't crash hopefully we have taken the win so if you guys like this video you guys want to see more make sure you guys follow me on all social media all, all of which are found in the description box below i just punched the mic and we took the win we took our first win in our drift adventures super awesome to take that first win we tied with him but we were able to take the win he won this round but we won the championship that's all that matters so we took our first drift adventure win which we're gonna get a wheel spin for i, feel, I believe or we just got a wheel spin in general and it's going to be the camaro zl1 i'll take it so we did take that win we are going to do some more of these, but uh, unfortunately, we're going to actually bounce out of this because we're going to have to do a huge update on this car if we're going to want to actually run it more. So make sure you guys follow me on all social media, all the description box below. As always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.